Hey, what's going on people? It's early in the morning. I should be sleeping right now. I got done work around 4.30 this morning, or I should say I got home from work at 4.30 this morning. And while I was getting a few things together, because I normally stay up, take the kids to school, I had my laptop open. And I had the security camera open. And just caught my eye. I saw this pickup truck. You're gonna see in the, in your, in the screen in a minute. I saw this pickup truck pull up in front of the house and it was kind of like cockeyed. He wasn't next to the sidewalk, but he was, you know, on an angle. And I wasn't really paying much attention. And at the corner of my eye, it looked like he rolled away and smacked into the uh, bumper of a family member's vehicle. You may remember that vehicle being the red Elantra that um, I've had to borrow a couple times going to work because of the Jeep being in the shop and also one of my uh, F11 top coat videos. But anyway, so I, I re rewound the footage real quick and I looked and sure enough, this nitwit got out of his truck, didn't put it in park and he rolled in and smacks the Elantra. So I go running out there and I see these two Spanish gentlemen, the one guy doesn't speak any English and they're talking and I walk up and I look and it's pitch black out so I really can't see and I'm, I, try to get the flight couldn't get the freaking flashlight on my camera to work for some reason I was like retarded um, this morning and I'm looking at the bumper and I turn around and I say hey you guys all right and the guy's like what I said we just hit the car so this idiot knows that he smashed into the bumper and uh, he's like no no uh, we didn't hit anything so you sure about that He's like, no, 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 we didn't hit anything. So I pointed to the camera in the window. I said, you see that security camera? Well, it caught you hitting the bumper. And I'm going to show you in a second. So I pulled it up on my camera. I showed him, oh, man, all of a sudden the amnesia disappeared. And the idiot was like, oh, uh, yeah, don't. there's nothing there. And he starts, like, buffing it and shit. He did. He, he messed up the paint. Now, it's not my vehicle, so... There's nothing I can do about it. Uh, I will show the footage to the individual whose vehicle it is and let them know, yo, this is what happened. But if it was up to me, and when you see up close the damage to the paint, oh, I'd be making them pay, absolutely. I had parked in front. Had they hit my bumper, I'd, have to, I'd make them pay. When they denied the first time and I showed them, all I asked the guy was, all right, no big deal. Just give me your license and your insurance. Because here in Philadelphia, uh, police don't respond to non-injury accidents. So if you get into an auto accident and you don't say, I have an injury on the telephone, they're not going to send out a car. So what they're going to do is they're going to tell you to exchange information. And you can get screwed that way. So if you're in an auto accident and there's no injuries, good luck. So I tell the guy, just give me your driver's license and your insurance, and he refuses. He says, call 911. So you'll see in the video, I have to call 911 and explain to them, this jerk off won't give me his information. Hang up, they say they're gonna send the car out and hang up. And I'm standing out there freezing my ass off because it's 40 degrees out and I'm in a t-shirt and pants. Um, finally, after I told him the police were on their way, he starts rummaging around. Now I can smell marijuana. I'm not making uh, accusations. If you want to smoke weed, great. But if he was under the influence when he hit the car or whatever, that was on him. Suddenly, the tune changed and he said, and his English got better all of a sudden. Oh, um, yeah, here's my driver's license and here's the information. So I'm a little agitated right now because I'm tired of shit and I want to get to bed. But I want to update this channel right now with this and this is why i always say get a camera if you don't have a camera get a camera uh, this security camera by the way for anyone wondering is a nest cam they originally called drop cams and then they were bought out and nest owns the company you can buy them at home depot or at least you could that's where i got mine you don't need to buy an entire system you can start out with one camera a little box about this big you bring it home you open it up you plug it into your computer, the software should automatically start. It'll ask you to name the camera, where it's going to be. You don't really have to do that. And then also, uh, 
connected to your Wi-Fi. Once it's done connecting, you'll get a little check mark. Congrats. Unplug it. Now plug it in anywhere in a house, anywhere where it'll reach your Wi-Fi. And now it's on and it works. And it's night vision. It's got all kinds of goodies. Go look it up. I'm too tired to tell you all this shit. But anyway, here's the video of the jerk off. And uh, I was going to narrate it and what happened or but like I said I'm too freaking tired but you watch and you see what this knucklehead did uh, maybe I'll put it in the corner the whole time but uh, if it ain't something it's something else so enjoy uh, please subscribe comment if you have any questions below um, I don't think I missed anything if I did oh well so I'll talk to you guys later when I'm in a better mood alright I'll talk to you guys later take care